This is going to be an opportunity for us to to create our vision as artists for, for, for Elephant and Castle and to influence policy. So say when I arrived to this country 15 years ago, Elephant was the first place I felt like being home um, because of the shops and restaurants were a place where we met or well, we're still meeting there. And um, so that for me is like the history. That was the first, probably, some of the first words I learned in English was elephant and castle. Regeneration is really not about buildings, as I've said, it's about people. It's about changing ideas of what is possible in people's minds. I mean, the nice thing about it is that you come to, to the Elephant and, Con and Castle and there's things that are happening a little bit underground, you know, which gives artists the, um, you know, the opportunity to experiment. So I think a lot of things are already happening which are invisible, which, may, which need to be made more visible. And, um, you know, and we can use this to sort of really build from. looking for is a gentrification process. I think what we like about the Elephant Castle, what is interesting about it is this kind of very, very rich cultural mix. It's this quirky quality which is very difficult to kind of put down, but there are qualities about the Elephant Castle which make it a, a specific part of London. Perhaps we should uh, support this idea of uh, difference and try to unify difference. And we're kind of all here, you know, Latin America perhaps seems very far away, but actually it's, you know, it's also here. And it's the same, I'm Italian. So sometimes, uh, you know, uh, well, there are Chinese and there are uh, Africans, you know, we're already all here. We don't have to think about global, something that's happening elsewhere. And also what we're talking is talking about is we're talking about the constant sort of grassroots thing that people value in the Elephant Castle and how you how you make those spaces sustainable so that they're constantly fed by people from the bottom and then given the opportunity for people to leave at the top. Artists show people things that they otherwise do not see. Artists open up a world of new possibility and change the way that people think and give them an ability to conceive of a different kind of future.
and we have sound engineers that work with us professionally, and they're very, very happy to offer their time to train people free of charge. You know. Mixture, believe it or not, of gin with all these muscle guys and artists, and it was very interesting because there was a World Cup on once, and everybody wanted to watch it, and there was open studios, and there was a merging of cultures that you've never quite seen before in your life. Um, but it was in What tends to happen is the students and the staff arrive, they come into college, at the end of the day they leave, they have very, very little interaction with the local locality. Yeah. And what I hope is, you know, it's something that comes out of the regeneration, is that something, you know, there is something here which changes that, so that the Elephant Castle is somewhere where, you know, you finish teaching, you go out to, because there are cultural events, mm -hmm. places to eat, etc., etc., the whole nature of the, the space changes. draining on anyone's resources but we're bringing like 50,000 people here to this borough you know a year we're putting on events and we're working with lots of different people I think it'd be nice if there was a, a young person space. If that space was able to be shared, that could be a very useful way of, um, of a social opportunity and a leisure opportunity being combined with a creative opportunity mm -hmm. in a space and linking up with other yeah. parts of the community that might not usually link up. With a group of us, we're looking at opening a public gallery here in LCC and it's not going to be a little one it's actually 450 square meters which has a public access from the triangle in front of the college our, our plans include a shop and maybe a, a restaurant or at least a place where you can hang out of course we're incredibly well positioned immediately opposite the tube I really enjoy uh, Siobhan Davis Studios because uh, they have this kind of uh, integrity in what they kind of did with the building and uh, what they offer and the ideas of, of sharing what they have. And um, perhaps we know, this is my idea, but there might be other organization that might be some sort of a models and then try maybe to find three or four models and try to uh, put them together in terms of uh, aims and the objectives.
And when you get it right, you have a place that people want to live in, want to work in, want to grow up in, want to play in, and want to visit.